Hello, welcome to the insights of microbiology. Today, I will explain salty tolerance test. This test is used to distinguish between enterococci species and streptococci species. Both species exhibit positive results on the bile screen test. Salty is the bacteria selective agent that interferes bacterial membrane permeability and therefore osmotic equilibrium between intracellular and the extracellular environments of the bacterial cell. Increasing salt concentration up to 6.5% of sodium chloride or the normal table salt in a growth medium inhibits a wide range of bacteria species but allows only salty tolerant bacteria to grow. Salty tolerant bacteria are Staphylococcus aureus, Enterococci species. These Enterococci species including Enterococci ficaris, Enterococci liquefaciens, Enterococci zymogenes, and the Enterococci dorans and the Aerococcus species, such as Aerococcus viridans and Aerococcus urinae. As I said before, the main aim of this test is to differentiate Enterococci species from Streptococci species, especially Streptococcus bovis and Streptococcus viridans, as both species the enterococci species and these streptococci species, they exhibit positive results on a bile screen test and a bit similar colony morphology on a 5% sheep blood agar. Therefore, they need another test to distinguish or differentiate them. The components of the test this salty tolerance test. When you want to prepare your salt tolerance test in a test tube or vial containing nutrient broth, nutrient broth can be brain heart infusion broth or triptych soy broth. Add salt the regular table salt or sodium chloride to a concentration of 6.5%. Color indicator, especially bromocreso purple may be added. Make sure your vials or preparations are sterile and clear before use. The testing procedure and the interpretations. Take two colonies of test isolates from fresh culture, a growth between 18 to 24 hours, and inoculate into salt tolerance test. The inoculated tubes or vials should be incubated in the ambient air between 35 to 37 degrees Celsius for 24 to 72 hours. A visible turbidity of broth with or without color change from purple to yellow indicates a positive result and vice versa indicates a negative result. Thank you for listening.